Ty Majeski will lead him as he approaches the restart zone. Christian Eckes on the outside. Green flag is in the air. We are racing at Martinsville. Eckes is hanging there. Look at Eckes hard down in the corner. Had a good angle getting in the corner. And then a good angle exiting too. And he's going to clear the 98 of Majeski, or is he? What a start. For yes, he does. Christian Eckes takes control of the lead here. Ty Majeski back in the second. Corey Heim back there in third. They're looking for a good run. There's a lot of new things going over there on over there at Rackley War Racing. And, oh, got a truck around. That's the 46. That's Thad Moffitt. Caution is out now for the first time this evening. We'll lead him here. Ty Majeski on the outside and stacks him up in the outside just a little bit. You see Corey Heim got in the back of the 98. Yeah, second start in a row that uh, the 98 was a little bit. Oh, Jack, Jack Wood. Jack Wood off the track on the inside. He keeps can it he rolling. Can he it around? Keeps it rolling. You can see Lane Riggs in that 38 trying to get that second position away. Look at this battle for second. Lane Riggs, more comfortable here on the short tracks. Was so happy to be here today in that 38 truck. And you can hang there for a couple laps on the outside. Good exit for wow. Majeski. Is going to be able to drive down in front of the 38? He is. He's clear. Watch right. that 91. He's bottom of your screen, the red and white truck. Oh, just got the nine got him, but it looked like maybe the 88 of Matt Crafton might have bumped into the nine of well, Brandon Finger. They were all checking up, and that's just one of them Martinsville. Christian Eckes works his way around. Looking to pick up his second stage win of 2024. Ty Majeski behind him, Lane Riggs, Corey Heim, Nick Sanchez, Ben Rhodes, Tyler Ingram, Jake Garcia, Caden Honeycutt, and Chase Purdy picks up the 10th spot. Christian Eckes on the older tires. Nick Sanchez, oh, stacks him up on the restart line side by side. You see him ducking all around. Chase Purdy back there in the 77. That was a nice dive bomb by Chase Purdy. He was able to catch Caden Honeycutt hanging on the outside. Sanchez gets over. Honeycutt's now stuck up top. I'm not sure that Sanchez spun the tires or maybe had a little bit of help from Honeycutt because right at the start finish line, he dove left. But again, I, it was either spinning the tires or had some help doing it. Let's see what happened with Tanner Gray here, back of your screen, the 15 right there. So oh. Matt Kraft, I don't know if, I don't, looks like Matt's truck just went straight. Don't know if he hit the curb and caused it to go straight, but he made contact with the 15 of Tanner Gray. That was all back there battling for the 24th position. Getting a report from the pits that Matt said something in his steering locked up, and it looked like that. He just went straight. Yeah, I didn't think he hit the curb, but for whatever reason, his truck went straight. and. Ready for restart, number two, Christian Eckes, Tyler Ankrum on the front row. Christian Eckes just nailing the initial start and both restarts so far tonight. Look at Chase Purdy up there in the 77, just behind Eckes. Tyler Ankrum trying to grab that second spot away. Caden Honeycutt with a strong run in that 45. He's Garcia so right behind. Impressive. That 13, a good top five run so far for Jake Garcia. 26 six laps to go here in stage number two. Chase Purdy doing a nice job hanging in there on the outside. It's going to get harder. The more laps they run, the harder it will be to stay there. Isn't this great, though? We talk about how many trucks could potentially win. Three wide for second. Oh. Lane Riggs goes around. That brings out the caution for the third time. Relay that to the spotter. Yeah. And Lane wants to know somebody to be mad at. Yeah, that's right. And he deserves to be. Yeah. Just got turned. You see Stuart Friesen right there in the middle of that mess. And the 45, Caden Honeycutt having a great night on the outside. Row number two, side by side they go into turn one. Christian Eckes. Oh, Eckes squeezing Purdy up the hill. That's not going to set well with Purdy. See the sparks coming out from underneath the 77. Look at that. Dean Thompson making moves on the outside, trying to bring Taylor Gray along with him. Great battle for the second spot with the 77 of Purdy on the outside. Is Ankrum going to be able to clear? He is going to he be able to clear it. Purdy. And did you see Purdy take it to the left so he could block off Caden Honeycutt? That was a solid move by that 77 truck. Corey Heim picks up that 21st spot, gets around the 76 of Boyd. Remember, he last pitted on lap 79. Oh, oh. no. And a tap from the 43 oh. of Daniel Dye. Two Maybe trucks go around. Lane Riggs went around as well. 
Spencer Boyd, we were just talking about him. He goes around. What a night it's been for Lane Riggs. Looks like Lane's into that outside wall. See the scratches on the wall, is he? Ty Majeski, William Sawalich. First time restarting on the front row tonight for William Sawalich on the outside. Nice and orderly into turn one. Ooh, nice move by Taylor Gray to grab that second spot. Solid restart by Ty Majeski, who has Taylor Gray just behind him. So Wallach is going to be able to duck over for a moment. And it's going to be contact. There it is. I saw the 71 jump in there. A little bit of contact. They all keep it straight. Yeah, That's Stewart made contact with Sawalich. Sawalich kept it straight. Trying to pick up another spot all over Stuart Friesen as well. Is he, he going to get, get two, two for, for one? one? Boy, Look did at that. that. Turn. Did that truck turn in the center of the corner? Wow. Could be the most dominant truck I've seen here in a while. He's just able to do things other guys Ooh. can't. Three wide, the 43. What a night he has had. And they're still crowding each other all over the place. The five of Dean Thompson trying to get through. He's been so solid all night. Here comes Matt Kraft. Remember, fresh tires on that 88 truck. Match just now outside the top 15. Oh. Oh, Ooh, man. That was a huge hit. What a bad break that was. Grant Enfinger straight into Dean Thompson. The caution comes out now for the seventh time tonight. Dean had no time to react to that contact. Ty Majeski. Been a great day for him. Can he hang on to the end? Nice start by Sanchez. And what happened to Majeski? Great restart by Nick Sanchez. Takes the lead for the... First time tonight, not quite. Ty Majeski coming back on the inside. They're battling back and forth. Here comes Ekis taking a peek. He moves into third. Nick Sanchez slips back. No more hold, but he takes it. Sanchez gets a little sideways. Christian Ekis behind him got a little bit sideways and slips into third. See if he can do it. Get a good launch. Pretty good launch right there for the 98. Nick Sanchez to the outside. Here comes Christian Ekis. In the 19. There's that. He, there he is beside. Eckes is beside Sanchez. He's going to have position on him when they get down here to the corner. Moves him up the hill a little bit. And he gets it. Christian Eckes into the second spot. The caution going uh, to come out again. Four trucks around Jack Wood. It, Cam it, Waters. Yeah, Jake Garcia in the 13. Wallace truck. Allen, who avoided the last incident. Now he's involved with quite a bit of damage on the front of that truck. A lot of damage to the rear of Jack's truck as well. Checked out and led that first lap. This is chain reaction. You can see started going bad up ahead of Raja. Nothing Daniel could do. He was just a victim of all that went down. And he was right in the middle of it with our. Here we go. Christian Eckes has found his way back to the front. He starts outside. Ty Majeski, a big restart once again for Christian Eckes. Doesn't get clear. Nick Sanchez back there looking for that spot. Wants to take it over. The best two, two trucks two right here. Two. These were the best two all night long. Look at Majeski taking Eckes up the hill, but he's still hanging side by side. 27 laps to go. Christian Eck is trying to get cleared. Led the first 100 laps of this race. Ty Majeski not giving it up. Contact right there. Caden Honeycutt just keeps on digging in the 45. Been involved in some issues. Called to the NASCAR hauler, but he's still digging. They're in the 12th spot. Oh. And they go around again. Lane Riggs is around. There's... Daniel Dye makes it through the 66, has big issues now. That's Cam Waters I think he might have, water. I might, he may have run into the back of his teammate, Jake Garcia. He said Waters is spraying water, Jamie. I did say that. Oh, you got to say stuff like that every now and then. What a day for Cam Waters as we're ready for this restart once again. Christian Eck is a monster restart again. And a struggle again for... Eckes, or excuse me, for Ty Majeski. Majeski, and he got punted a little bit by Sanchez, but good, good tight racing up here in the front. And lost that second spot to Sanchez. Now Ankrum is side by side with Majeski for third. Ankrum wants a piece of that. 77, Chase Purdy back there. Taylor Gray. Great battle between those two tonight. 
See the nine of Grant Infinger right on the back tailgate of Stewart. Looked like Grant thought Stewart was going to get in the throttle. Stewart didn't. Around you when you see Matt run in the back of Grant, then oh. Matt's also going to make contact with Stewart. Slight contact. Stewart kept her fired up and rolling. Christian Eckes hangs on to it coming out of turn four. What a perfect night it was. Eckes gets it done. He'll take on the grandfather clock at Martinsville. Let's go. <laughs> you win. Job, buddy. He went. Ty Majeski secures that second spot. Chase Purdy, great effort by him.